What is happening, y'all? Welcome back. So, this is where we fought our first Big Blue. And we're going to continue on through this path. As opposed to taking the other path. So, I'm hoping, you know, I didn't find a Mistal on the other side. I'm hoping that this side will lead to a Mistal. And, uh, that'll be that. Oh, oh my god. This area suck. Fire. Hey, wow, this is Dark Knight class. Once you get leveled up a little bit, it's pretty fucking bonkers. Because we're hitting not quite as hard as I was with, like, Greatsword or Hammer. But we're hitting hard enough that, you know, two swings are basically more damage than I was getting. Oh my god, I can see the Mistle. I can see the Mistle, but there's stuff that way. Thought there's stuff that way, but now it's just a permanent wall of fire. Yeah, I see it too, Mia. I see it too. No, Mia doesn't take fire damage. Shit. Why do I take fire damage and you don't? Shitty. There we go. There's a rotten mistle. Oh, it's so nice to be able to see. And this does not take me over to that mistle, though. So now we gotta go on by. So that shit is uncovered and set. Uh, this guy has an erection for me now. That's not fun. Um, you mistled some stuff earlier. Now you are not needed. So now we need to take the other path, the one that we bailed on. I got... I thought I'm all mistled up. It's... This way. side of things. God, that means I passed by that fucking mistal earlier. Literally walked right past it. Uh, yeah. Thing in this, uh... Oh, fire monkeys. Isn't that a vestige? Looks like a, I don't know. I guess it's just shit on the ground, but it looked like it was a vestige. Uh, do we go through there? We do. Okay. Well, now that I got this, this is a. And now the raised cityscape. Add on, add on, and we are ready to boogie. Uh, you know, approaching this area from this angle makes a lot more sense. Now it's like instead of a. Uh... Actually, I'm gonna hang it. It's a near dickhead. As much as I wanna use Fire Tonic, I have a feeling I'm gonna need it for the boss, so we will hold off on using any more tonic.
so that's that. It's not an alternate path, so I do want to run through this one. You know, as much as it, it irritates me that she doesn't take fire damage while I do, it's definitely good because if our AI was just wandering into the fire and burning themselves, I'd get pretty fucking salty over that really quickly. This way, you were our queen's titanium, bro. For being queen's titanium, he is just drops. Not a very strong bad guy. Um, is this or I run down that path? Yeah, isn't that the? Oh no, drop. Let me see. Yeah, no, this is definitely the path I took. It's just to be clear, because I mentioned uh, you know, just adding in a fuckload of steel and iron. I'm not going to immediately do it with the titanium. Um, but if I reach a spot where titanium starts dropping like candy again, and I probably will, just to upgrade everything so I can try everything on out. As much as I'm swapping weapons, I'm just am not going to be spending hours anymore farming, because I'm trying to get started on the fucking walkthrough. This is still the Let's Play. So I'd rather upgrade shit and try it out and kind of get a feel for all the different classes and whatnot. Um, this loop me back around to the treasure rails. That way, <clears throat> for the walkthrough, I can know where to go, what upgrades to get, what is worth spending your upgrade mats on, which is always a big thing in games like this, in my opinion. Yeah, this is, uh, this is you, sweetie. Giant rolly ball. Oh, there we go. Took your sweet-ass time shooting that thing. I'm starting to really like that ability. Because even though it's like, you know, I had that one thing I was using to pull stuff as melee that only cost one. The Dark Knight has a good bit of uh, extra Iker to spend. So, like, spending four isn't too shabby, especially considering I'm getting what I would consider to be some pretty respectable damage. Oh shit, oh god. That fire thing that guy made on the ground? Oh my god. 
Jesus, what amazing timing on that thing. And that's 100%. Okay, so we've made it to the boss. Now we can work our way backwards and just collect the shit we missed. Looks like it's a sweet spot weapon. <laughs> well, for a second, it looked like I was hitting. We're off to test that. Oh, dummy. Another queen titanium. Vestige. That. Um. Okay. Two. I got enough healing. We'll just run through this first. Shard medium. More queen titanium. Steel. ST activator. Another Scathith Vestige. Uh, can I see Vestiges? Scathith. A, B, C, D, E. A, B, C, D, E. Lengthy little run to get whatever that shiny is. Lost Shard Barge. I think this is the real reward. Burn Warhammer. Bad Monkey. Alright, so looking at the map and... Looks like we've hit everything. I picked this bad boy up earlier. Oh. I mean, it costs 10 to use, which is ass, but it lets me save my homework bones. It was uh, Coco Street that had that. Uh, so let's look at the new stuff we picked up. What's that? Oh, Crimson. Uh, uh, lost heavy axe, which is just a scaling. Burned warhammer, warhammer warped by sustained exposure, intense flames. Does it have a cool move? It looks like something big's about to happen, and then just poof. 
That is, uh... <laughs> that is pretty disappointing, I gotta say. Right. Additional meal from Coco. Let's spend our stuff. Right, 15 minutes, which is good. And let's, uh... Oh. Ember reversal, strength, willpower, time crunch. Riker to speed up charged actions. Fires a flaming projectile that arcs to cover the user's rear. Huh. Well, let's go through it. Um, we probably won't even fight the boss this episode just because of how long these little mini movies take, but. Uh. <笑>ゾーンが来てる。くそ、そう、次から次へと。逃げ、逃げ、エミリー。一度交代するぞ。もうため。足が動かない。頑張れ。あと少しの辛抱だ。<笑> Like, Yakumo deserves to be in these memories with me. See this shit? Shokujigawatara,またすぐに出撃だろ。今のうちにしっかり食っておかないとな。調子はどうだ、エミリー。もう大丈夫。薬物ちゃんのおにぎりで元気出たからこのところ連戦続きだったからなあんまり無茶はするなよどうしたんだこんなところで早く寝ないと明日に響くぞこれからもずっと緑になりなのかなって思うとさなんだか眠れなくなっ
Give me the last one. よかったエミリーも目が覚めたんだ何がどうなってるの確か化け物に襲われてそれで二度の野郎が言ってたよ俺たちはレブナントに生まれ変わったんだってヤクヤクも他のみんなもあとは目覚めを待つだけだって So hold up. <laughs> Mito took them, adopted them as children, did experiments on them to make them into basically super soldiers. And then after they died, brought them back as revenants? What the fuck? That's the one I did. Oh, let me run. I hate this forced walking. Kimi Tachi no Okage de E sample got tiny high high day. Queen wa taure. Jindri wa aratana shinka no hoga o matti. Kimi Tachi no sarana no hataraki ni kitai no shti. By the time Yakuma woke up, what's her face was already a successor, and his other guy seems dead too. All right, well, we're at 23 minutes. We can we can uh, tackle the boss, I think. Some fire tonic on, probably. Is she like a spider? Fly? She's some kind of insect thing, I bet. Oh no, what the hell? Fiery Catwoman? I should pop a fire tonic the second this starts.
not the way we wanted you to go. I mean, Dark Knight seems to be whooping ass, though. I'm getting out a lot of damage. Like, I'm not chunking the same way I was as, like, the hammer or the sword. But I'm way faster. I just whack, 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 whack. Strength builds definitely seem to be the the op -er of things in this game. Because so far we've done... Uh, we've done strength with hammer with greatsword. Now we're doing strength polearm. Um, I mean, every time we do strength, the bosses just melt. Since we're in a whole new thing, let's um, let's wrap up here, and then we'll learn more about Emily and what happens after that in the next part, given we're at like 27 minutes. So we'll close on out, and then we will pick right back up from this exact spot in just a little bit.